Hey guys, I'm really sorry about last week. I actually did completely forget. Um, Alex, I'm sorry. I will really try never to forget again. Like today, I actually almost forgot, and then I got back from class at six o'clock, and I was like, ah, I have to do my video. So obviously, I haven't really been thinking about it. Like today, I wasn't thinking about what three things I want to do before I die, which is really crappy because now I have to come up with it really quickly. So I was looking around my room and I sort of um, have like the three things that I want to do. One of them is kind of like a short term goal, the one is kind of like a like a medium sort of term goal, and then the, the third one is like a long term goal. Um, so yes, I'll start. My short term goal is to finish reading all the books I want to read, and I have them right here. I'm just going to show you. Um, I really like reading. I haven't had a lot of time to do it lately because I've been studying a lot, but these are the books that I'm trying to finish now. Um, this one, I read one, two, and three during the summer, and then school started and I did not have time to finish it, so I'm trying to finish all of these. I don't have the fifth book. If anybody wants to buy it for me, that'd be fantastic. Um, this I just got recently. Um, I know it's kind of lame to get the like essentials thing because I'm too lazy to go and actually try to find all the books. Like the starting comics, the first issues. So I've got this, which is not the best quality, but it's a good good place to start, I think. Um, this, which shouldn't take very long. These are really funny. I really like them. Uh, this, which is another one that's just kind of like a compilation of the best zombie comics and I really really like zombies like I said in my first video I love them so much Sorry. Um, this I started reading I'm almost finished it's a really good book this I also started reading I'm not nearly finished but it's really good also I quite like it it's funny and very scientific for anyone who's read it it seems like it's so legit I really like the author um, this I haven't started reading yet uh, I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but I have all these BMV stickers. Anyone who lives in Toronto, if you're looking for cheap books, really good books, go to the BMVs. They're amazing. I love them. And um, this, which I started reading like two years ago, and for some reason, uh, never finished. So, those are all the books that I'm trying to finish now, as well as studying and doing all my school stuff. Um, that's my short-term goal. My medium-term goal is... To finish learning French, um, it seems like everybody who wants, who wants to learn a language is like, I don't want to learn Spanish, I don't want to learn French, they're too mainstream, blah, 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 blah. but um, I really like French, like French is like my, my passion in life, um, so yeah, I'd like to learn French, mostly because um, I want to go back to France eventually, and I want to be able to talk to my friends in France in France. French. When I was there, I was like, I'm really nervous. Still, when uh, Mathieu, who is my exchange partner, calls, I can't talk to him in French because I'm really nervous that he's going to like make fun of me. So I want to be good, and I want to be confident in my French skills so that I can actually talk to him and not... Like, he speaks to me in French and not answer in English, even though I know I can answer in French. Yeah, I need to be confident enough to speak French to French people. That's my medium term goal because I already know some French obviously I just need to finish learning it um, I think it's really funny that whenever someone says I want to learn a new language but not French or Spanish like those are the two that I'm taking um, in school and also Catalan so there's like a fine line it's like I don't want to learn Spanish or French because everyone wants to learn Spanish or French I want to learn something like Russian or Ukrainian or Portuguese um, and that's like acceptable, but I'm also taking Catalan, right? Like I said, and that one's like apparently too obscure. Every time I tell someone I'm taking Catalan, the first question is, "What is that?" And the second question is, "Why would you take that? What's the point?" Um, it's an interesting language. I like it. Uh, I can't really say anything. I can say, "What day is it?" Is Quindi Savui? So if I ever go to Catalonia and don't know what day it is. Useful stuff I'm learning in this class. Um, right, and my long-term long -term goal. Oh, what was it? I can't remember. Books? French? 
Oh, right, right, right. I want to learn um, how to touch people, which sounds really creepy um, now that I've said it out loud. But, like, right now I really don't know how to touch people. Like, I don't want to. I don't want to learn to like touch people. I don't think I'll ever like touching people. But I want to learn how to do it, so that at least it seems normal. Because like right now, even uh, like hugging people, I can't do it. Like I actually physically can't do it. Like um, with my dad, even and my parents, like I do kind of like the bro hug, where you just kind of do like the one arm kind of like pat on the back. Like that is how I hug my parents. It's really awkward. Um, and. Well, my boyfriend, I hate, I hate that word so much. I hate that word. There's so many words I don't like, and boyfriend is one of them. When he is like, oh, hugs, I'm like... I just stand there, like, I, I can't. I can't do it. It's like the hardest thing in the world for me to touch people. Or like giving people high fives. My friends make fun of me all the time because instead of like making full contact high five, like just like, you know, hardcore high five, it's like, eh, and just... Like, there's that little bit of space. So now, as a joke, they just, they go, like, and just stop or hurting my hands. Like, there's just something about it. I cannot touch people. Um, so I'd like to develop my touching skills. Which, that sounds awful. I just want to accustom myself to being touched by other people so that I don't, like, cringe away or make a face. Because then I feel bad. Like, it's not them, it's me, which is stupid sounding, but it's true. It's all me. I have such a hard time touching people. And it's not about germs. Um, anyway, I'm sort of just rambling now. So, at the end of the video, I will not forget next week. I promise you. Thank you for watching. See you next Thursday.